The C200 is capable of 2K resolution and 30 frames per second and it comes with its really nice inbuilt red privacy cover which is controlled by the switch on the top. It is completely made of plastic with dual microphones on the front as well as a white light to let you know when the webcam is active. Air vents are present on either side as well as the anchor logo on the one side. A USB-C port is on the back for the removable USB-C to USB-A cable and as this is enclosed by the surrounding plastic it does offer some some protection to the port from accidental knocks to the cable. The rubber pads on the inside allow it to be mounted onto a screen and not cause any scratches. There's no rotation on the head so it will need to be positioned towards the center of your screen but there is a quarter inch thread on the bottom to mount it onto a tripod if you want more flexibility when it comes to positioning. It comes with an adjustable field of view where you can select between 65 degrees which is the most narrow field of view where you will be the center of attention and not much of your background environment will be in the shot. There's there's also 78 degrees where more of your background will be on display and this will make you appear a little further away from the lens of the webcam but it would be great for getting another person into the frame. And finally there is a 95 degree option where even more of your background will be on display and this would be ideal if you need to get multiple people into the frame for a video call or if you want to move around and still be seen. It can be used in a completely dark room and this is us sitting in front of our monitors on our PC so there is some light coming from those. You will lose some frame rate if you begin to move around due to the lack of light but it is certainly usable. When we're a little further away we did notice that the autofocus will try and recalibrate itself so for the best results you will want some lighting on yourself. Bringing in natural light and it does bring an improvement to the image and we look crisp when we are close to the lens. Do expect the autofocus to adjust itself when moving towards an away from the lens but you can prevent it from doing this which we will show you shortly. When we're sitting in front of our computer then the autofocus does perform much better. As we are next to the window then this does make us overexposed but if you are an OBS user then you can go to the settings to manually configure this and get a much better final looking result. If you are using bright ring lights in front of yourself then you will need to manually configure the exposure so you don't look washed out. Changing this allowed us to get a really good looking image and we're looking really crisp. There is still some focus searching but if you are an OBS user then you can uncheck the autofocus box and this will completely eliminate the focus from readjusting itself. Focusing on a small object work well with it adjusting quickly to keep the object in focus. We do get a more blurred image if we come two inches or closer to the lens but anything further than this and it picked up the focus well. Removing our green screen using OBS and it did a really good job at removing it. We are overexposed by our bright ring lights but once again this can be sorted by manual configuring the exposure just make sure that your lighting setup for the green screen is better than ours and comparing it with the inbuilt webcam on our laptop it's clear to see that the C200 is a massive upgrade with a much more clear image and much better color representation. The dual stereo microphones have the ability to switch from omnidirectional to directional which will filter out any noise over 90 degrees which will result in a much cleaner audio experience. This is what your microphone is going to sound like using the 180 degree omnidirectional setting. This is a microphone test using the 90 degree directional setting. This is the kind of audio you can expect. The Anchor Work software can be downloaded and installed and this will give you the option to downgrade the resolution from 2K and this is a software which will allow you to change your field of view but if you find that these are somewhat limited then you have the option of manually zooming in and using the on-screen keyboard to move the frame to get your desired result. Basic image settings are available to fine tune your image to your liking as well as the white balance configuration and the option to flip your image. This is also the software you will need to change the pickup mode of the microphone where you can toggle between the 90 and 180 degree modes and if you would like to see more anchor webcams in action then be sure to hit the video that is on screen now.